Life has been life in. Life has been life in. Life has been life in. Let's start this over. Shot shot to your P31. She played y'all way before me, and she must be the one. Wizard come out of her tongue. She gotta go hurt, see the poor. She open her arms. And she pray before she see the sun. Have y'all been going through it like me? Because I've been going through it. Like, I've been going through it. All right, let's start over one more time. <clears throat> welcome to my channel. It's Misha Azali. And if you aren't new here, welcome back. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. It helps YouTube push out my video for other people to see, which in return helps me. As you can see by the title of today's video, this is a productive Sunday reset vlog. And like I just mentioned, I've been going through it. I've been going through the motions. So today I said, you know what? I'm just gonna try and do like a Sunday reset vlog. I got a few things to do around the house, including my laundry. I have to go to Walmart to even get some detergent. Detergent. I have to make a Walmart trip. I'm gonna try and take a walk outside and just clear my mind from, you know, the last few days and just what's been going on, just to get like a fresh start, get ready for this next week. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to take y'all along with me. Not much we're doing today. We're just going with the flow. So come along. I hope y'all can hear me. But earlier in the video when I said I've been going through it, I have. That's not a lie. But I choose not to get stuck in that. Like we go through ups, we go through downs. That's life, you know. And I just feel like when I do experience my lows or just like going through a rough patch, I just choose not to get stuck in that. I allow myself to have my days where, you know, I can self reflect. I may feel down a little bit, but one thing that keeps me going is I know that God got me. So I try not to get stuck in that space because one thing about God, he's always pulled me through and when I look back on previous situations where I was just going through something and God put me through, I just imagine like, what if I spent, what if I spent all that time being stuck in that space of being depressed, of being stressed out? I would have just been wasting time. So now what I do when I go through stuff, it's not easy, but I pray about it. I give it to God and I let it go. And I think some people think that's, some people may think that seems irresponsible because like if somebody know you're going through something and you walk around and you look carefree, they may take it as you just don't care. And people may think that about me, but that's where they're wrong. I walk around not with a carefree attitude but more of an attitude of gratitude because I know, I know God covering me. I know he's working it out on my behalf and I know I already prayed about it and let it go. All I can do is what I can do. Nothing more, nothing less. So I'm not gonna, you're not gonna see me. I mean, I allow myself to feel down sometimes, but I just refuse to walk around stressed out, depressed. You know, you don't know what battles people are fighting behind closed doors. I don't always talk about exactly what I'm going through. Um, Cause I give it to God. I just give it to God. I was just walking and a mouse just ran out and I know I look crazy as hell. I look like a tweaker. I got on my tippy toes <laughs> and started running. Then something it's too much. Something just flew over my head. I don't know what it was. Then I started ducking. It looks like, I know people in the car is probably like, what is she tweaking on? See, I try to get outside and do the right thing, but stuff like this, uh-uh. But anyways, <laughs> I just want to say, see, now I'm tweaking. I just want to say, if you're going through something, it is okay to pray about it, give it to God, and let it go. Go about your day. Do everything in your power that you can do to change the situation. Everything else, let God handle it. Don't let nobody project their fears on you. 
don't let nobody project their doubts on you. Pray about it, leave it to God, do what you gotta do and move on. People gonna talk, they ain't none of your business. Keep it pushing, know that God got you. Everything that, everything that happens, God allows it to happen. Let me turn this way. Everything that happens to you, God allows it to happen. And it's biblical that he says everything that happens is for our good. Whether we like the outcome or not, a lot of things, most things we won't understand. But just let it be. Pray about it. Let it go. Do what you can do. And let the rest go. Period. Oh, yeah. Don't follow nobody but God. I was supposed to be going to Walmart to get my detergent and stuff, but I'm going to the pool first. It's too hot. We gotta beat the heat today. All right, I know this was a, pro a productive vlog, but before I run my errands at Walmart, we are going to the pool to try to beat the heat. And then, cause it closes at 5.30, so afterwards, then we'll go to Walmart. <laughs> bye bye. Tiny! Tiawa! 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 This water feels good. I'm gonna punch whoever that was. I'm drowning. Hold on. I'm gonna knock you out. I'm not, I knew it had to be Tierra or Tayshawn, and it was Tierra, of course. I didn't want to have to wash my braids, but it looked like I'm gonna have to wash my braids. We're in the lap pool right now. Seven feet. Perfect way to beat the heat. There goes the other one. Huh? No, you saw you. Go, let's go to water with me. Huh? Okay, Sean, I'm gonna take y'all under the water <laughs> with him. Okay, here's something to do the world. Okay. You ready? You gonna hold it? Yeah. Here you go.
I was getting ready to upload this video and I completely forgot that I didn't close it out. Today is officially Monday, it's the next day. So I'm just adding this on here just to say thank you guys for watching this video so far and I will see y'all on the next one. We do got a family hike coming up that I'm assuming is gonna be really funny because none of us are prepared, but we all told each other we're gonna do it. So I'm gonna vlog that too. So stay tuned for that video. Again, thanks for watching, I'll see y'all next time.